Ready? Ain't nobody want that conflict, conflict. Shining in a brighter than a common, common. Pick that issue when I hit you like a missile. You've been not rocking with that pickup, fix up. So at the time of recording, there is one day and 11 hours left of the Rocket League Beach Blast Summer Event. And with that, of course, come all these items. I did buy every single one of them with all the shells that I earned and one Beach Blast crate to bring me up to 50 Beach Blast crates in my inventory. If you haven't yet got all these items, try and grind Rocket League for some shells. It just would be cool, I think, for you to have all of these in your inventory. I've got every single limited item from each event in my inventory. But in this video, I'm going to be opening 50 Beach Blast crates as a farewell to this event. So I've only done one, I think, um video opening these crates so i don't actually have a lot there's uh there's the sunray boost which is really sick i've got the i got these wheels in white in a trade up some painted crux wheels would be incredible and the beach party would also be kind of sick because it's something that i don't have and with less items in the crate maybe the chance of getting those is a little bit better but nevertheless we're gonna get straight into this 50 crate opening after i give a massive shout out to logo.com who are sponsoring this video that's where i got the keys where i got most of the crates and they really helped me out really really help support the channel so i'll play their sponsored intro leave a like if you want to see more crate openings like this in the future with different crates different ideas crate wars challenges that sort of thing uh and let me down in the comments etc but i'm gonna play their sponsored intro and then we're gonna get in to opening these crates before we do continue this video i want to give a massive shout out to logo.com a lot of you know who they are for sponsoring this video you can go over to their website so you can buy gift cards for PSN, Steam, and even the Nintendo Switch. They've got a really expansive site with very helpful and responsive live chat. So thank you so much, Logo, for sponsoring the video. You can check their link out in the description. That's going to do it for now. I hope you all enjoy the video. So yeah, I don't think I have any painted crux wheels. Let me just have a little look. See, see, see. I don't have any crux wheels whatsoever. So I would really, really like some because they look absolutely awesome. Like... Genuinely look really cool. I'd love some more Sovereign ATs. Summary boost looks epic. Honestly, imports and above, they look super, super cool. Let's get it. Let's go. The Crate King is back, hopefully, for this video. And I am, of course, recording with the super high quality camera. So I'm going to have to turn off the recording midway through the video because it only records for 16 and a half minutes. But I've been grinding out videos today. I did the... Um, I filmed the two trade-up videos that I recently uploaded earlier today, like within the last hour, and I'm filming this now, then I'm hopefully going to make another Fortnite video, and I've got to edit them, render them, get them all up in like a few hours, because I'm kind of spending a few days away from home for Gina's birthday. She's over there on the bed chilling right now, but um, yeah, it's her, uh, her 19th birthday on the 3rd of July, uh, so it's already been her birthday at the time you're watching this, but I obviously want to be with her and spend that time with her, and normally I'm at home making videos, but I won't be doing that this week. But then after that, I'll be grinding out videos till the end of August when I go on holiday. So it's it's going to be sick. So this little grind day is like my last big push till I get a little bit of a break. Uh, not that I haven't been enjoying it. I've been really enjoying making videos lately. But yeah, so that's where my head's at. That's where my life is at. Let me know down in the comments how you're doing. Uh, especially if you, have you finished school yet. I know a lot of any American viewers, I think you finished school. But oh, oh, there we go. Painted exotic wheels right there. What color is that then, ladies and gents? Woo! Okay, let's have a little look at that. It's a really good start for the Crate King. Anyway, like I said, I know a lot of you in America. It's orange. Not too bad. Okay. Uh, I think actually all of you in America will have finished school by now. But I know if you're in the UK for at least... Uh, most years, unless you've got like particular exams like GCSEs or A-levels or whatever, you won't finish until, you know, a couple more weeks time. So I'm... I'm seeing you through. I know it's hot, particularly in the UK, but you guys can get there. You can get through. But anyway, let's keep going. Look how solid these black tunicas look, by the way. I really like the black painted, like, uncommon exotic wheels. They're so nice. We just got to get the dicey wheels next time in the next attempt. But hey, first five crates, painted exotic. I'm taking that. And we're getting a sunray, which is super cool. You know, imports for an import trade up. That is going to be awesome. Because I think this is my biggest... Beach Blast crate opening. I think I've actually only done a 20 Beach Blast crate opening, which means I had one, I had enough items for one very rare trade up, and I got white Sovereign Wheel. So that's a super cool trade up for the Beach Blast. But other than that, I, I've not had one import to exotic trade up yet. So that's why I don't have the Beach Party, and I've not had a chance to paint a Crux Wheels. And with my trade up luck lately, I'd rate myself to get something. So I'd like Beach Party in a crate, and then I'd like, obviously, a white or black or red Crux Wheel. In, uh, in the import trader. That's basically the goal. That's like perfect. That's like the ideal scenario. But I don't think necessarily that's going to happen. But hey, it is what it is. Let's go and boom. We're still only eight crates in. So we're 
we're at, we've got plenty more to go. I'm excited. I will probably throw in a nose crate here and there because that's uh, definitely a good one for me. But we're going to get the rare. So next crate, we're going to do a drink water crate because, you know, you've got to stay hydrated. Got a little bit of water right here. So we're going to do that right away. And bam. Here we go. All right. Let's see how we do. Come on. And a peacock. Animus GP peacock. It's not really what you want. To be honest, not what you want to be looking for. Let's start on those Crux wheels. I've seen, I think I've seen, I saw a white one when the event came out and I was really impressed. Looked super, super cool. Um, obviously with like, like, I feel like now people talk less about the, those particular items in the updates. Like back when White Zombies came out, when Dracus came out, the painted versions were all hype. But as there is less hype surrounding the game, they are talked about less. So you don't hear a lot. I haven't heard a lot about the painted Crux wheels, but hopefully we can still get it. So come on, please game. Nine lives. Wasn't there it? There was the Venom Nine Lives. That was a Champions Crate 2 decal, wasn't it? Are we running out of name ideas, Rocket League? That was definitely a thing, right? It had like the cat, skull, and crossbones, I think, as the picture. And C2 came out like nearly two years ago. So, you know, it's crazy. OG right here. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's been like. Yeah, it's been over two years since I first uploaded Rocket League onto this channel. Uh, which is awesome. I think the first time I uploaded Rocket League into this channel is when Hoops came out in April 2016. And it is now, it's now July. Can you believe that? The first half of the year is already gone. And I mean, it's been a really good first half of the year. Crazy. Uh, I definitely couldn't have predicted anything that had really happened this year so far, if, if you asked me last year. But it's been going really well. And I'm super excited for the next half of the year and just the rest of my life. It's going great. I'm excited. Torrent. I know we got a, uh, a Titanium White Torrent, I believe, in my first and only, only Beach Blast endeavor as well. So let's see. 35 more crates to go. Can we do this? I think we can. I'm not going to look. Give us the good stuff. Come on, game. It's probably a rare. It's just... Yeah, it's... Breakout nine lives. It's not really, yeah, not vibing that, to be honest, kind of creepy. Maybe, maybe that, I think that would have a better place in the Haunted Hallows crate, to be honest. That's not the coolest thing I've ever seen. Oh, peacock. Well, look at all those peacocks, man. What's, what's going on there? What is going on there? A painted peacock, however. We're going to start on what item we got in the last crate. We're getting some pretty... Dodgy crate luck. Yes, we got painted exotic, but it was only orange and the rest. We seem to be getting a lot of rares. So let's try and mix that up. Give us a beach party. I'll take a Leviathan. I definitely will. Nice. Import animated decal. Looking good. Honestly, look at that. That looks like a black market. Like one of those low value black markets like Spectre or Stormwatch. That looks severely cool. For an import decal, that is... That is really good, so. And to be honest, it wouldn't surprise me if they ever came out with, like, exotics and they had an exotic that looked just like the Sovereign Wheel before this came out. So, there we go. Crux Wheel. I would have rather the beach party underneath it, but we've got ourselves an original to compare anything we get to it, so that is cool. It's kind of an orangey-looking wheel anyway, so the fact we got painted orange isn't, isn't the best, but I'll have to take what I get and take it as it comes. This is probably the crate I've been least hyped about. I mean, the Haunted Hallows crate was kind of less hyped, but I there was a lot more hype around Rocket League, so I was kind of encouraged to open more. The fact that I, this by the end of the event, this is only my second Beach Blast crate video is actually pretty crazy. But, hey, it means I can appreciate the items in it, such as the exotics, because I really haven't had any chance to get them until now. So we got some Quimbies. All right, little Quimbers. Like it, like it a lot. Boom. Okay, 29 more to go. Come on, ladies and gents. I feel it. I feel it. Whew. Come on. Come on. Proptosis. Nice. Exciting. Not what I'm looking for at all, but... Again, I'll take it. It's, it's trade-up material. Man, I love seeing those black tunicas, you know? They look extremely cool. I'm really glad to get to have gotten those, because I'm... I'm as I said in my last video, I'm thinking about doing the whole very rare and then exotic trade-up thing, like those two videos, every week. Um, 
it, maybe I'll do it every week for like July and then in August I'll do it every two weeks uh, just so it's not overkill because they're really exciting videos and like I said before I don't get what I want first time like with the import trade-up videos but I don't want to do them too much you know oh, I definitely want to do more gameplay videos but it's just it's just hard I've got so, honestly I've got so many ideas but it's hard to just get in and actually make them sometimes especially with how busy I've been lately but it is what it is so I think this is our 25th crate which will put us at the halfway mark and it's going to be another nine lives. I think that's been our most favorite item of this crate so far, which a little bit frustrating. But hey, we'll, we'll forget about it. It's painted. It's gray or blue or something. 25. Here we go. We'll do another water crate. And we're out. That is it. Some more Quimbies. Let's do a mouse crate. We'll open it with the mouse right here. Come on. All right, okay, use key. That, that's not it. It's not a good start. Use key and then beach party. I don't I don't feel like I need painted crooks wheels right now. Beach party would be great. Instead, we're going to get the Island King. Not sure how I'm feeling about this. Not sure at all. Let's, let's le lean back. Sovereign ATs, they're super cool as well. Wouldn't mind one of those. A few more imports and crates to get some import traders would be awesome. Look at all those imports just flying by. Oh! Oh! There we go! There's the import! Painted Sovereign AT wheels as soon as I mention it. The game gives me one to match the car, I think. What color actually is that? Um, import. Purple. Okay, I th first thought it was blue, but then it looked more purple when it's actually on the car. All right. So we've had painted crooks and painted sovereign wheels. Come on, give us the beach party in a crate. You know, you know you want to. That'd be great. And to be honest, although people probably hate me for it, I uh, probably not the white sovereign wheels, but the purple ones. I probably will just trade up if I need to. If I have like eight imports and I can keep a few, I'll keep them, of course. But if it comes to it, I'll probably trade up that one because I really want a chance at either the white crooks wheels or the beach party explosion, even that. Like, it'd be bittersweet if I didn't get Beach Party in the crates and I had one import trade-up and I got it in the trade-up. Because that means I did get it, but it means I didn't get another chance at a painted Crux wheel. So, I mean, I got the chance, but I didn't, unfortunately, utilize that chance. So, we'll see how it unfolds, but I think it's going to get interesting. And uh, we're getting a circuit board. There was another circuit board. Ah, it was a decal, I think, the circuit board, right? And that, that banner matches the decal, I believe. Or it was either... No, I think it was a paint finish. The circuit board paint finish, actually, that you could put on top of decals. Other than black market ones, of course, because they have they are in themselves a paint finish as well, I think. More Nine Lives. Welcome back to the family. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Here we go. 18 more crates remaining. Can we get some decent luck? We've got three minutes left on the, on the uh, base cam. To try and do some bits. <laughs> Let's see what we got going on here. Quimby. Woo. Alright. Alright. Okay. Okay. I am I get what you're throwing down. Certified. 17 more crates to go. Ladies and gents. Okay. That one. Something feels a bit off about this crate. What is it? What's it going to lead to? A circuit board. Okay. Again. I think we've got five circuit boards alone in my inventory now, so that could be one trade-up in itself. We definitely will have at least one import trade-up, which is good. But the fact I've come nowhere near close to getting beach party is kind of upsetting, worrying. Don't know what word you'd uh, call it, but... Proptosis. All right, okay. Okay. I see. Come on, ladies and gents. We got this. We got this. I say ladies and gents a lot now, don't I? It's kind of like my... My introduction to everything I say. I'm like, all right, ladies and gents, this is it. Island King. Yes. <laughs> oh, man. Come on. Stop doing us so dirty. 14 more. I'm going to do a nose crate after this one. Bring it. Whack the nose crate out and see how it goes. But this one, I think, is going to be a very rare. Nine lives. You know what? I probably could have put my life on that if I really thought about it. <laughs> On it being that. But anyway, nose crate time it is. Wait. Bam. Ah, that. Ah, everything feels uncomfortable now. It's not good. That is not good. Okay, come on, nose crate. 
the peacock. Okay, we need some more luck. I'm resetting the camera. I'm coming back. You'll see a cut right now, but it'll be in like two seconds for you, so it won't it won't matter to you. All right, 12 more crates remaining, and then trade ups, and then we finish this this video. Come on, come on. I know there's no black markets, but you can give me the white crux wheels, you know, if you feel like it. Proptosis. That's what my eyes will be like after after I'm done with Rocket League when I'm like 50 years old. My eyes will be hanging from their sockets just at what I've had to deal with in this game. Come on! That's a crazy thing to think about, you know? It's, I've said to people, like, YouTube, like, it's unrealistic to think I'll be doing YouTube in, like, 30 years, but I don't know what else I'd be doing, so maybe I will be doing it in some kind of capacity. At which point, will I still be playing Rocket League? Probably not. But, because in, like, a year or two, it's fine to think about the, the lifespan of games. But we don't have a lot to go on when it when it comes to gaming in 20 years because if we think back to 20 years ago, there wasn't really a lot around. I mean, there there was there was like there was Game Boy, there was PlayStation One, uh, there was there was a lot of games, but nothing like the games and the multiplayer stuff we have now. So it'll be really interesting to see how in the next five, 10, 20 years gaming goes because it's a big part of my life, and I'm sure if you're watching, especially this far, it's a big part of your life as well. So we got a lot to look forward to. I think I think it's going to be absolutely awesome. We're living in the golden age. And then in 200 years time, people will look back on us and think, man, look how primitive these people are. <laughs> They'll evolve beyond the need for physical and like verbal speech. They'll just do everything in their heads. Oh, a bit of lag for another nine lives. That beach party looks really nice. But we're going down to the cats. Bit of lag and it's not even painted. Rocket League's done me dirty there. I think maybe this is one of the crater things where we peaked too soon. Get these on properly. There we go. Hey! I think we've got some painted Quimby wheels. <laughs> Colors like these glasses have like a filter on, so these are really distorted. But black Quimbies, I think that's what that is. Let's go most recent. All the way to the top. Nope. No one wants to sort me out here. We're going to look. Paragon black Quimby. See, they got the same sort of um, flair. As the Tunicas. So if we go up to the Quimby's real quick. Up here. They look really nice actually. I really I really like those. But nevertheless, let's continue with these crates. Six more crates to go. And then we will have the trade-ups where we will hopefully get something. If not, it's no big deal. It's just to say goodbye to the, the Beach Blast event that was has been taking over Rocket League for the past month maybe i would say month maybe four weeks perhaps bam and i'm glad that i played the game enough to get all the shells that i needed i bought the decryptors i did the video on that uh all that good stuff didn't get very good decryptor luck though four rares and a very rare so my worst round of decryptor luck in an event yet and to be honest my probably my worst my worst round of crate luck in an event yet as well because i had pretty good haunted hallows luck pretty good secret santa luck yeah i've not been doing too well what was a spring one spring fever I think I had better luck than this, at least, in the Spring Fever crate. But I can't really remember. So, yeah, this is the fourth event Rocket League have done. They've done Halloween, Christmas, Spring, and Summer. So, I guess the next event will be Halloween again, maybe? Or maybe another Summer event? But then, who knows? You know, the Rocket Pass will be coming up in a few weeks, I'd imagine. I, I think the next big major update will be the Rocket Pass, which is going to be amazing! I'm so, so excited for that, by the way. Nine lives again. We're getting that a lot. A lot. Ah, I should make a thumbnail with these glasses on. I might do that. I should make these glasses be it. Because it's a summer beach blast event. So sunglasses make sense. I'll probably do that. Oh! Oh! That would have been so cool. To get the beach party. Final crate before the trade-ups. Let's get a beach party right now. The 70th beach blast crate have opened. Let's finally get the beach party. Come on. Oh, we got the peacock. Okay, we got a lot of trade-ups to do, and I'm excited to do them right now. Bam. Okay. Let's scroll up to the top. What have we got? Hey, breakout nine lives. So many. Let's go. Certified torrent. I suppose these are just going to be pretty dead by this point. Boom. Quimby wheels. I just traded up all of them, so now I'm going to have to scroll down or something. See, why is it the inventory so broken? I was not down there. I was up at the top. 
I don't even know what I'm looking for right now. Let's just go to rares. There we go. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam. Circuit board. Thanks for, thanks for turning up. Peacock times two. We'll trade that. We'll trade up everything. Got a torrent. There we go. Quimby wheels again. I don't mind not getting painted right now. <clears throat> okay, we can keep those two and trade those up. Boom. Torrent. Okay, now we're going for very rare's most recent. And it sent me all the way down to the bottom. Okay, here we go. So we've got 4, 8, 15, 20. So we can trade them all up. We might not trade up the last one and keep the black and black Quimbies and white Torrent, but we'll see what it's looking like we'll have import trade-up wise. Sunray certified. Okay. Come on. Where's the anything? Torrent? Where is it? Am I missing something? Uh, I don't know where all the stuff is. Oh, Torrent's right up there. Oh, this one most recent. I was looking for alphabetical. Rage. Boom. Leviathan certified. Okay. I think we won't need to trade up all of the very rares because I don't know if we'll have enough imports for more than one trade up. But let's give it a go. Certified sovereign wheels. Okay, now. All the way up here. To Okay, so if we need one more import, I'll do it. Imports. So we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, yeah. So we can trade up that. We can trade up these four. So basically, it's a choice between keeping the white sovereign wheels or black quimbies and white torrents. So I'd rather have the white sovereign wheels trade up the purple one, sadly. I'd rather have the white sovereign wheels than the black quimbies and white torrents. So we are going to get two very rare trade ups right now, which is super, super duper cool. So if we just go to all items, very rare. See you later, quimbies. It's been real. White torrent, you too. Sunray. Okay, now we get two chances. So hopefully we get Beach Party and White Crux Wheels to finish them off. All right, that's what we're going to aim for. Have I done this wrong? Have I done this wrong? Three, five. Wait, what? There's five there. And four there. That can't be right. Wait a minute. Have I done that? Did I, did I miscount? There's four there, and five there. Did I not just get normal sovereign? I did, there. So got five there. Oh, I can only do one trade-up, I think. Right? So I've got... This is... Okay, this is really... This is boggling me. So we've got... Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, man! Let me just check the very rares again. Are there any very rares from this? This There's not, so we get one import trade-up. I kind of don't want the beach party now, but hey, it means we can... We can keep a Leviathan. Keep a Sunray. Yeah. Alright, here we go. We'll keep our other stuff. This is the only trade-up we're going to do. Bam! Normal Crux wheels, man. That hurts a lot. That hurts a lot. Let me just check. I mean, I'm not going to use the white sovereign wheels, am I? I'm heavily considering it. You know what? I've had these wheels for nearly a month. Never going to use them. Never look to sell them. We live for the thrill. I do it so you don't have to. If we get a beach party, that's fine. Let's go for it. There we go. We got ourselves the beach party. We got the explosion. We got all painted crux wheel. Yes, I lost my white sovereigns, but I thought about it. I'm never going to use it. We got the goal explosion. I'm, I'm happy with that. We've got the butterflies from the spring fever. Uh, we've got happy holidays from the secret Santa. And we got the vampire bat and reaper from the haunted hallow. So we are rocking the event goal explosions. Nevertheless, that is going to do it for this video. If you did enjoy it, be sure to leave a like on it. Subscribe today to join the Pixel Army. I've been Pixel. You've been awesome. And I'll see you in the next video very soon.